one beautiful hello my name is Sid welcome to the Borderlands 3 diamond collectors edition I don't even know deluxe diamond I don't care I got a big box all right here we are back on my phone a little bit of inception here okay so we're gonna take our biggest knife I can get it open our biggest knife wow that's kind of cool so many knees and we're gonna cut this gigantic box hold on I have to find a good way to cut this oh this is so bad why did I pick such a big knife? Let me just slide it along. Okay, something fell. One thing I wanted to point it out, point out, point it out. Uh, this has a do not sell sticker. I've never seen this before. That's because you can't sell it before the actual day. Jesus Christ, this thing is so big. I need, I literally need another person to film this for me. Okay. Ooh, baby, that was cool. I'm gonna go to the floor. Oh yeah, there she is. I literally had to switch from my desk to the floor. It looks pretty, pretty cool. That I'm digging. I'm not digging the fact that I gotta put it together because I'm really lazy, but kind of sucks there isn't something like super big other than this and the actual box itself. So let's get it out. So I got the PS4 edition. It's got some crazy cool artwork on it. The Children of the Vault. Children of the Vault. Some stuff, I don't even know. Bunch of cool things. That's pretty cool. I wanna cut that out. I might, I don't know. And, ooh, up we go. Get out of here. Yeah, this is what I'm most interested in, is this. This looks cool. I might actually cut this out and make it something. I don't know. Um, oh, interesting. Mine's already been opened. Huh. That's weird. That's really weird. Why is it already open? Okay, you guys saw it here. Mine's literally already opened. Like there's extra stickers on it. I need the big knife again. Because somebody already cut it open. Pretty poorly too. They weren't using a gigantic knife. Interesting. Yeah, man, mine's already been opened. It's got rips. What? This literally just came like 30 minutes ago. Interesting. I want to see if this has been opened. Oops. Oh, now it's ripped some more. But that's weird though. It's already got rips in it. Hold on. Okay, here we go. So to open it, pull the release, pull the release. It goes up. Back. Oh, that's actually really cool. Is it stuck? Okay. We've got, what are these, the lithographs, I think? I don't know, there's something. Um, protective, so none of the protective stuff got messed with. Just the box got opened. I don't understand how that happened. It's supposed to be brand new, because I bought it from GameStop. Interesting. A vault key, Mimos, Mimos? I don't know what these are. I really want to see these a lot of people have been talking about these and the fact that they're not painted i don't really understand why they didn't they look kind of cool back panel for contents loot crate inclusive okay i don't understand why they weren't colored though that doesn't really make sense you'd think a colorful game like borderlands would have sent figurines all colored i don't know that's interesting to me this is what i'm really hyped about and get it out. Oh yeah. One to two hundred. Okay. Can you not? How do I... uh, guys, how do I get it out? There we go. Okay. Yeah, that's cool. Sanctuary three, which apparently is a ship. I literally have no idea what's gonna happen in Borderlands three. I've been trying to keep away from all the stuff, even though it took me, it took UPS like two hours to get my stuff here. Oh well. And we got the Borderlands 3, what is this, the cloth map thing? I want to pop this open. Hello, leg. How are you? So it's a map that's supposed to look well-worn. Pretty cool looking, I guess. I don't know. I'm not very... I don't know. I kind of expected more out of the map, maybe. I don't really know what's going on here. Maybe it's because I haven't played the game yet, but... Interesting. We'll figure it out together. What is it? Okay. Alright, on 
the next thing. And we got Torg's package delivery. This is probably gonna be all the posters, I'm assuming. Kind of cool that Torg's face is a little missile. I dig that. I don't really want to rip this. Right, there we go. Camera right on. This is gonna be probably all the posters of the characters. That is a blank sheet of paper. Okay, so this, this is gently, ever so gently. Oh, cool, it pops open. So we've got Zane, we got Flint, we got Moe's, and we got Amara. I want more. Ooh, the Calypso twins. Okay, I dig it. And another blank sheet of paper. Oh, that's pretty neat. Like I said, I, I kind of expected, I kind of hoped there was something real big, you know, other than just the box. I guess the box is kind of what you're looking for. I'm going to go ahead and pop these open. These are the, uh, what are they called? The little vault thing. Dude, there we go. We got our vault. Key looking keychains. Pretty neat. I don't really get why they chose four keychains, because like I'm gonna put one on Children of the Vault. Spiky ball. Okay, cool. Vault key and a uh, triangle. What this was. Let's see. Ooh! Oh, this is my steel box keys. Alright, this looks pretty cool. Uh, I dig it, the Calypso twins. And then you got I'm guessing this is the, uh, hmm, an empty box. Okay. Uh, uh what? Mm, okay. Interesting. Uh, very interesting choice. Let me, let me set this down and see what this is. Is that this box is literally just an empty box. This is supposed to be where you would put the game. Oh, now, now I did it, now I did it, okay. Yeah, this is where you're supposed to put the game. And then, this is the actual steel box cover, which does look kind of amazing. It does look really good. I really do the steel box cover. Even though I kind of hope they'd gone with the similar Borderlands 2 one, but I'm fine with it. Okay, let's see what the disc looks like. And here we go, there's, oops. There is Borderlands 3 for the PS4. Uh, just so you guys know, I'm gonna give away a shift code. So throughout the video, I'm gonna be putting in uh, parts of the code, you just gotta look for them. It was part of getting Handsome Jack up there. He came with a shift code, so I'm gonna give that away, it would be nice. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not be gonna be giving away the Super Deluxe Edition codes because that would uh, rob me of them. So I'm not gonna do that. But I'm gonna give away a shift code so you guys can get a golden gun. I don't know if the golden guns are available in they're not golden, uh, the golden key are available in three because I literally don't know yet. But this is everything that comes in it. Um, actually, hold on, sorry. I look at these. Okay, all right, so here we go. Here are these guys. Uh, let me flip that around. Um, how do I really think about it? Um, looks pretty neat. Like I said, I really expected them to be colored. Maybe, I don't know. I kind of dig it because it's kind of like uh, Tiny Tina's Assault on Dragon's Keep, sort of. That's upside down. I'm literally upside down. I'm stupid. I have to flip that in post. Yeah, I, with Tiny Tina's Assault on Dragon's Keep and the whole Dungeons and Dragons style, I guess. Okay, here we go. Pop this mini open. We got instructions and we got work, more work, and pieces. That is actually pretty cool looking. See, my thing is, I don't, am I going to have to paint it, you know, because I kind of expected it to look like that, but I don't know if these like, 20 stickers are going to cover it, you know, I dig that it's a, it's a model, but like I said, I don't really get why, I, uh, honestly, I expected something like that to like light up or do something or, I don't know. Because it's got all these ports for stuff on the back. Like, I can't. Ah, come back to me. Come back to me, my brother. I'm just going to crush everything. Yeah, it's got these ports on the back for stuff. But they don't do anything. None of the buttons are operational. And the power button doesn't even move. I really expected it to do, you know, kind of like something. And I don't really get what's up with the... 
I get they guess the new I guess they got like a new style for the loot boxes. I really expected it to be more like the, the ones from Borderlands 2. I guess it's a good move in, in the right direction, more kind of like space, like space suit sort of thing. I don't know. But overall, I, I dig it. I, I really wanted it just to kind of support because I got a, I really wanted the Borderlands 2 one, but unfortunately I didn't get it. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Remember, be awesome and goodbye.